Once your photos are on your PC, you'll want to sort through them and fix any that haven't come out as you'd hoped. The Fix option in Windows Photo Gallery is located in the top menu, next to File. Clicking it reveals a list of five options on the right. Auto-adjust is the simplest of these. Put simply, the computer decides the right colour and lighting settings for your image. However, it won't always produce the result you want. As you can see here, Auto-adjust has changed the picture's colour, giving it a purple hue that isn't ideal. Clicking Undo will restore the photo to its original. The drop-down menu on the right of the Undo button enables you to choose how far you go back in history. If you want to save time, the keyboard shortcut Ctrl-Z will undo your changes one step at a time. Adjust Exposure lets you change the photo's brightness and its contrast. If your photo is overexposed due to a camera's flash, changing the brightness may restore some detail. Changing the contrast adjusts the difference between the lightest and the darkest colour. A higher contrast will result in a more punchy image, but you'll lose light and dark information and it's easy to overdo. Adjust Colour deals with the image's colour temperature, tint and saturation level. The most useful slider here is saturation. A dull image can be transformed into a vivid, colourful shot simply by adjusting the slider. Similarly, if a portrait looks too red in the face, you can adjust the saturation to give a more neutral shot. If you're not happy with the framing of your photo, you can crop it. You can define your own box, or select from set proportions to match your print media. If you're printing on 4x6 photo paper, for example, use a 4x6 crop to ensure your print looks the same as it does on a screen. If you decide that a portrait shot would look better as a landscape, or vice versa, you can choose to rotate the frame to give you a landscape size box. Fixing red eye is very easy with Windows Photo Gallery. Drag a box around the eye you want to fix, and the red will be removed instantly. Once you're happy with the image, return to the main gallery by pressing the Back to Gallery button in the top left corner.